A matrix is a rectangular arrangement of objects called elements. The plural of the word matrix is matrices. All right, so let's see, what does this say? It's a rectangular arrangement of objects. Okay. So I'll put a triangle, put a star, and put a little dot, and a plus sign, and a minus sign, and an X. All right, here's a rectangular arrangement of objects. Hmm, okay, so I guess you'd call this an, a matrix. This matrix has two rows, and it has three columns, so it's called a two by three matrix. Now, in mathematics and science, most of the time, our matrices are going to hold numbers or data. And uh, so let's take a look at a matrix that's storing data. Okay, let's see here. Um, let's take some data on Sean and some data on Mary-Kate and some data on Mariel. We want to put it in a nice organized form so that, you know, we can access it very, very quickly and efficiently. Data that we've gathered. Sean is seven years old. He's in first grade. He's 50 inches tall. Now and he weighs Kate is 18. She's in 12th grade. She's 72 inches. She's six feet tall. And she weighs 130 pounds. Now let's think about this. She is a very, very, very tall, very, very, very skinny young lady. Then there's Mariel, 75 years old. She's in fourth grade. She is 63 inches, so she's 5 foot 3, and she weighs 95 pounds. This is, you know, this is a visual as well. It's amazing how if you just know what the headings are, you can read across a row of data and actually get a visual now, it's picture. It's possible to take this same data and rearrange it into a matrix um, in a slightly different way. Here we took the, the data for each person and we put it out across in the rows. We can take the data for each person and put it in columns as well. Sean's age was 7, his grade was 1st grade, his height was 50, and his weight was 100. All right. So it's a different rectangle. This rectangle is a four by three. Four by three, whereas this one was a three by four. Three by four. Now notice, we're looking at the exact same data, but it's presented in two different matrices. These matrices, even though they hold the same data, are not equal. Two matrices are equal if and only if their dimensions are the same and their corresponding elements are equal. Two matrices are what we call equal matrices if and only if their dimensions are the same and their corresponding elements are equal.